All right, let's bring it back out now live to the looting that's happening, the protests that have been happening overnight. The situation has been changing minute by minute at times. Some areas have been too dangerous for our crews to get into. Our Chris Eggert is out in the field for us this morning giving us a closer look at some of these really dramatic images, Chris. Incredible, really. Yeah, Megan, uh, we're at 29th and Lake Street right now, and you can see this burning building here off the left-hand side of your screen. My photographer in the car here, Chris Canole, says that building's been burning since the middle of the night last night. Right here on the right-hand side of the screen, that is a shot spotter. That is a camera from the police department that has been knocked down. There are at least 20, 40 people along this area. We're approaching 28th Street. And we're along Lake. There's a pawn shop that looks like it's been gone through. There is smoke hanging in the air everywhere. There are alarms going off from all of these businesses along here. And street lights are out. It's unlike anything I've ever seen. It is absolutely unbelievable. Within my vantage point right here, I can see 30 different businesses that have been ransacked and this is the police precinct you see off to the left we're turning left and just about five minutes ago there were at least 20 officers stationed out there and it appears that they just went inside moments ago situation is continuing to change here moment by moment there is still a lot happening though and there are still a lot of people out here and it looks like people are still helping themselves to what's left in these businesses uh, we're going to send it back to the studio and we'll we'll reconnect here again in a little bit megan okay yeah we saw the police precinct damaged two nights ago and then folks gathering there last night and to see the damage and just chris was saying miles along lake street several miles businesses smashed in dozens of buildings Apple store, jeweler stores, convenience stores, grocery stores, you name it. Wow. The light of day is certainly uh, beginning to, to shed a lot of light on exactly the damage that, uh, that has happened overnight there. So we've got reporters uh, stationed in the area, including Chris, and we'll check back in with